Welcome, welcome to Reactober Day 15. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, y'all, before I jump into a reaction for today, I am just going to jump into a little scary tale, okay? A little wicked tale, a little scary Halloween tale, a little story, and I brought my little trick-or-treat boo-hoo right along with me okay anyways y'all already know knock knock lights out guess who it's lala come out and play trick-or-treat i ain't smelling your feet but please have me some good vegan food to eat Ooh. anyways y'all so are y'all ready? Okay. You gotta stay up on my shoulder now, okay? Oh, don't choke me too much now. Anyways. This is starting to scare me. And I'm worried, okay? This is scary. I'm starting to worry. Her baby is right beside her. Oh, is he frightened by her? What a blank stare. But she don't care. She's all about that TikTok chair. Wanting to hold his bottle, but don't know how. Cause of the wicked clown. Always on YouTube, giving a ugly frown. Only if he could take a step, but somehow he don't have it yet. She continuing to have babies to gain her special check. She know it's a delay, but she continues to lay. But she feels like it's the power play for him to stay. Is starting to scare me. It's not fair to baby legendary. I'm starting to worry. She for real scares me. <laughs> Can't practice with her kids, but love playing with these random wigs. But not doing what's best for her kids, the end. Now, we display black couple goals, okay? But how about we display parent goals, okay? In my little spooky, scary story that I just spoke, which is my Halloween tale, somewhere in there, it's Lala. She is starting to scare me because I am worried about baby legendary, okay? La love the kids. I don't play around with the kids, okay? At the end of the day, when you want to get on YouTube and try to slay, you need to take time out of your day and make sure baby legendary is okay, okay? I know at the end of the day, it's all okay because this is, like I said, the game that you play. You feel like it's a power play in order for him to stay. It's not. What you are doing is continuing to have kids, bring them in, but not put your focus on them, not put your time into them. You understand? It's not a game. Because someday, 
these babies have to grow up you understand and so many of them have to lack and be behind because of what their parent did not do what their parent should have done but chose not to do because instead of me sitting there I like playing on the TikTok chair. You don't have time to play on TikTok. You don't have time to play on TikTok when your baby can't hold his bottle. You don't have time to make TikTok videos. You don't have time to get on here and address negative things. You don't have time to get on here and address, address reactors. And your baby ain't taking steps, okay? But your baby is definitely not holding his bottle. Now, many of y'all would take my scary tale story and try to twist it like I'm coming for the kids never do a lie I come for the kids I come for the adult you understand because the kids they, they ain't responsible for themselves it's the parent and what the parent gives you understand not only did we sit back and we watch with the twins with Aiden she waited so long you knew there was something wrong but she waited so long not that she waited so long <laughs> She just always wanted somebody to do her job for her. But she loved to display all the, da the babies that she make or want to make. But you're not putting in the time or the effort to make sure that they are okay. Okay? To make sure that they are developing as they should. You're not doing that. Then that makes it harder on them at the end. Are you sitting here and just playing in your little TikTok chair? And I say, why are you playing on TikTok? When was the last time you was trying to practice with him of holding his bottle? Then I would say, what do you tell the doctors when you go? Do you tell them that he is doing everything that he should when he's about to be about to turn one? What do you do? This is so sad of you, okay? It's embarrassing. I wouldn't get on here talking about having no more kids. I'm just saying. And then I'll sit and I think like, okay, well, if there's something wrong and they're lacking something, maybe she get a check for it. So it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay what she give. It's okay what they're not doing. Okay? Because remember, she is money hungry. Okay? And any way that she can get a coin without going out there trying to really get it, she'll do it. Stop bringing these innocent kids in. And then you leave them hanging at the end, okay? And then that's where I would say, this is starting to scare me. I feel worried, okay? It's not fair to Baby Legendary. It's not fair to Aiden. It's not fair to none of them kids. You understand? Now, this is the end. Happy Halloween. Trick or treat. Knock, knock. It's Lala. Lights off.